Oh, hey, hey, hey. Plastic with you? Temporary. Usual. Hey, hey. How you doing, man? Listen, I got a shit hot tip for you. Number five in the third. Lickety split. That Philly's one hell of a chaser. You wanna flutter? Last shit hot tip you gave me sent me back a week's wages, baby. Come on, this is different. It's a hundred percent guaranteed. You can't go wrong. Yeah, right. <laughs> All right, I'm in. Damn straight. Hey, won't regret this. What is your problem? Don't you ever do as you're told? Look, you don't have to follow me around like a poodle. I thought now might be a good time to review what we know about deviants. No, now is not a good time to review anything. Now is my lunch break. So just go into standby and cut me some slack, okay? There you go. Ah, oh, thanks, Gary. I'm starving. Mm. I'll leave that thing here. Huh, not a chance. Follows me everywhere. See? Enjoy your meal. You didn't pay for your milk. Gary's a friend. I scratch his back, he scratches mine. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Why do you hate Android so much? I have my reasons. Is there anything you'd like to know about me? Hell no. Well, yeah. Um, why do they make you look so goofy and give you that weird voice? Cyberlife androids are designed to work harmoniously with humans. Both my appearance and voice were specifically designed to facilitate my integration. Well, they fucked up. Maybe I should tell you what we know about deviants. You read my mind. Proceed. We believe that a mutation occurs in the software of some androids, which can lead to them emulating a human emotion. In English, please. They don't really feel emotions. They just get overwhelmed by irrational instructions, which can lead to unpredictable behavior. Emotions always screw everything up. The androids aren't as different from us as we thought. <laughs> this morning, when we were chasing those deviants, why didn't you want me to cross the highway? Because you could have been killed. I, and I don't like filling out paperwork for damaged equipment. You ever dealt with deviants before? Two months back, a deviant was threatening to jump off the roof with the little girl. I managed to save her. So I guess you've done all your homework, right? Know everything there is to know about me? I'm focused on the case, Lieutenant. The rest doesn't concern me. I just got a report of a suspected deviant. It's a few blocks away. We should go have a look. I'll let you finish your meal. I'll be in the car if you need me. Hey, 
Connor! You run out of batteries or what? I'm sorry. I was making a report to Cyberlife. Uh. Well, do you plan on staying in the elevator? No. I'm coming. Now, what do we know about this guy? Not much. Just that a neighbor reported that he heard strange noises coming from this floor. Nobody's supposed to be living here, but the neighbor said he saw a man hiding an LED under his cap. Oh, Christ, if we have to investigate every time somebody hears a strange noise, we're gonna need more cops. Hey, were you really making a report back there in the elevator? Just by closing your eyes? Correct. Shit. Wish I could do that. Anybody home? Open up! Detroit Police! Stay behind me. Got it. This place stinks. Well, looks like we came for nothing. Our man's gone. RT. Probably initials. What is your initials in his jacket? That's something your mom does when you're in first grade. Its LED is in the sink. Not surprised it was an android. No human could live with all these fucking pigeons. Any idea what it means? RA9. Written 2,471 times. It's the same sign Ortiz's android wrote on the shower wall. Why are they obsessed with this sign? Looks like mazes or something.
looks. I thought I was the last guy in Detroit to keep some. Uh, electronic books, you can't smell the paper. See the pages turning yellow. Seed. I can't believe it. This nut job was actually feeding these fuckers. Doesn't matter. We know what it looks like. It won't get far. Come on, let's get out of here. Seen enough vegetables for one day. That shouldn't have happened. I wasn't programmed to fail. Oh, well, you fucked up, Connor. Welcome to the club.
don't know. It looks like a note, but it's indecipherable. Doesn't matter. We know what it looks like. It won't get far. Come on, let's get out of here. Seen enough vegetables for one day. That shouldn't have happened. I wasn't programmed to fail. Oh, well, you fucked up, Connor. Welcome to the club. Thank <laughs> you.